chance to in your bathroom. nice obviously like when we moved in I bought a whole bunch of stuff but it's not it's not giving like cute cute vibe it's actually a really really nice size bathroom but on the back of the door I've got my two dressing gowns and I've also got this thing <laughs> Which Luke always is not a fan of. My bathroom is a full shower one. In the other in the other bathroom, we have got a bath. On this side, I've got this little caddy with all my stuff on. In a video I did, I think it was like around summer last year, I got all these new little containers and cleared out everything and just like restocked and reorganized a whole bunch of stuff. But like I'm still gonna go through everything today and just like just resort it out and check if I think I need to buy some restock. So we're also gonna do that in this video. Some of these containers so this is tanning body lotion this is all spares this is hair care makeup this is all my skincare i do want to get like a nice little shelf thing to put some of my like cute bits on do you remember when this like i'm talking years ago was like a primer that people put under their makeup it's like it's like a men's post shave box it's quite like tacky i got on that trend this is obviously years and years ago so this is well past expired so this can go i'm not ready to go and buy some new bits but let me show you Maybe a couple things that I'm thinking. Probably will just end up keeping the towels, but definitely a new hair towel. I'm really trying to be on my hair game, and I feel like this isn't doing This is very much lockdown vibes, and I want to get a proper hair towel. I've got all my vitamins here, so I'm trying to be more of a vitamin girly, and I need to have them out, but I'm thinking maybe you could find a cute way to store them because this is not, this is not the aesthetic, you know what I mean? Maybe we switch up these, I don't know yet. Don't know how much stuff like that costs now. I also want to get like a little container for all these reusable cotton pads because these, these just really annoy me, but I don't really know where else to put them, as well as maybe a couple prints. But I feel like stuff is so expensive now, so I'm gonna have a look, gonna go to Primark, my favourite shop ever, Sauce and Green. If you know, you know. TK Maxx, I don't really know where else to go. Yeah, we'll go to Manchester, into city centre, and have a look, see what we can find. I'm in Primark and I'm gonna, cause I can't, I've come in the morning to hopefully try and find some stuff before it gets too, too busy. So I'm currently in the home section. Obviously in Manchester, the home section is very good as well. But first thing I've spotted is, you know I mentioned about getting like some prints for the walls. So I thought maybe I could always get these because they're two pounds, that's not bad. And then put in my own print, food for thought. But I'm gonna go have a look at a couple other places when like Sauce and Green, TK Maxx and see if they've got any prints. At least I know this stuff here, but all the spring stuff is out, which is gorgeous. So I'm gonna go and try and find the bathroom stuff. These are really cute. I could do in the corner of the bathroom because I've got some fake tulips in the kitchen, which look really realistic. They're really good from Amazon, but it's cute already in a pot. Oh, I don't know, I want everything. I actually want everything. This bedding. How freaking cute. We could do a whole flat makeover. Stop, look at this. Oh my gosh. I swear I could actually find a use for every single thing in here. But what I do want to look at is all these fake plants because I do want to either get a fake plant or put some like eucalyptus up in the shower. So I was hoping maybe they had some like fake eucalyptus or something, but even just like a little something for like the corner because the real plants ain't surviving. I think I might get one of these to maybe put inside the shower into one of my holders to make it, I don't know, like hang it over the side. These are all the different bath mats I've got and I really like like this. I think it's so cute, like the blue and the pink. But let's see how much, so nine quid. I don't need, need one, you know what I mean? No, let me get the other stuff first and then I can see how much I've spent and then see. Oh, they're so cute though. This is their little range. To be fair, like I'm not too fussed. Like, I feel like I'm fine with what I've got if this is like the only option. This is cute, kind of. I feel like that wouldn't really fit on my sink though. The sink is quite small. This is also their colour towels. I love like a pink, but I feel like I'll just get, like not be not a fan of it so quickly. So I feel like I'm going to stick with the towel, stick with the bath mat. If we move, I'll probably want to redo it all again, so I don't want to just waste money, you know. I feel like these vases, everyone's got these vases from Primark. Maybe I could get my fake tulips and put them in the this one as well. I think that might look quite cute and just brighten it up a little bit. What do I just get these? I don't know, I feel like maybe a bit bigger would be better, but that's way cheaper. I was also looking for a hair wrap, but this is the only one they have, but it's not 
microfiber, it's just like normal towel. We don't even have any like nice shower caps or anything here, so hopefully the other places do because I've only got plants, so I've got a lot more that I want to get. Or oh, I'm going to get this one. <laughs> Next up, I've just popped into TK Maxx to have a look at their home stuff. To be honest, I feel like I never find anything good in TK Maxx, but I know people love it, so we're giving it another shot. Hopefully they have some stuff. I feel like Primark just didn't hit. I've got loads of these, but obviously I don't think I need another one. Unless I wanted to get one to put at the end, then add in my plants. But I don't know if that's just so much effort. These are the different um, soap dispensers they've got in here. But again, nothing that really stands out. Oh, I found so many more. Okay, like that's cute. I just found this and I actually really, like look at the flat, that's so cute. So it's 10 quid and this is, I don't think you put my skincare on it. It wasn't really, I don't know what I had in mind, but I feel like what I have in mind was always just what I saw on TikTok. But this is different and it's got flowers. So I think I might get this. Or is this one cute because it's got the white outside instead of the the things. So I don't know, I might get both and then try them and see what I like. I'm in Boots this morning and I'm going to start off by looking for some bits to fill up my boxes and stuff I'm making. So one thing was vitamin C and I always come to Boots because it's always three for two. So I think I'm just going to grab one of these. I've been really enjoying taking magnesium at night, two before I sleep. So I get two of them? Yeah, I'll get two of them. I'm having a look again for a shower cup, obviously, and a microfiber towel. Shower cup, I'm thinking something just quite plain oh like this this one I finally do have this one but to be honest, I don't want to spend 15 quid on one so I think I'm either gonna look on Amazon for that or maybe go back to TK Maxx or something I'm gonna grab some more nails while I'm here as well these are the ones that I've got at the moment I've got like a whole list of like the quarterly stuff like the toner serum moisturizer that you get but they don't have quarterly here so that's gonna be an online purchase and then I'm just going to grab a moisturiser and then I think that's all I need from Boots. I popped into Sasha and Green to have a look and see what they've got. This is the most beautiful shop ever. I found this cherry dish as soon as I walked in. I was also looking for stuff for my friend's birthday. This is the print options that they had. They were cute, but none of them were like screaming at me. To be fair, this one's kind of cute, but kind of a bit spenny. But they just got gorgeous stuff in here. If you have one near you, I highly recommend. The prices are so random, but they have really cute stuff like this. They, that like little soap thing was really cute. It's fun. They've got really good range of candles and i am just obsessed with every single thing in there we've got a haul i'm very very excited i feel like the shopping trips went really really well oh. <laughs> this is jewelry cleaner for my tiffany necklace this is the home stuff stop no I was expecting a full-size version. They're tiny. Oh, no. I mean, we'll try it, but I think too small. I got some lights to put under the cabinet. I grabbed a pill box to put my pills in. These I'm really excited for, so I got some prints. I've decided to go frameless. There's 11 different prints to choose from. I think these are so cute. So excited to put them up. I thought that might just complete the whole thing because when I'm filming as well, like in the background, you can see the little prints, which I think will be so nice. From TK Maxx, I did mention that I did want a hair. Oh, what's it called? Hair towel kind of thing so i picked up this set which has a towel and a turban wrap to put your hair up you saw me get this cute little plant I'm very excited to get this in this, i think this might look really really good or just not good at all we have fake tulips tulips are my favorite flowers if everyone wanted to know or this is a different op option um in a little woven basket thought this might look quite cute you saw me debating on the trays i got both and I found another one. I don't know what will look best in the bathroom because it's quite gray. I don't really know if just white. I didn't really go, want to go for just white, but let's go set all that. I think that is stunning. I feel like you can't, you can't not do that one, you know? I was thinking maybe three. This one might go quite well. No, stop, because these are all the ones I went for. I thought that the yellow and the pink kind of tied in quite well. Unreal, and they were like 10 pounds. I'll leave everything I bought that I can find linked down below so you can get it as well. But like, now I've got so many other ones. I can switch them out. Next thing is, obviously I've got these trays. Initially like white probably goes a little bit better because like the walls are all white and everything. I think these ones are cuter. Get out all the pretty products, you know? The, the quarterly stuff. This is kind of the idea of products. I don't know like, 
I don't know if I need like, I just thought the case of this is quite cute, but I, I don't even use this every day. So I don't know if I wanna do like everyday kind of vibes or if I wanna do like, cute skincare kind of vibes, you know? So this is the first option. This is the second option. And this is the third option. I think I definitely prefer like the wooden kind of vibes. I'm gonna move on to this corner because I feel like the more stuff I put out, the more that'll determine what I want for there, you know? Is that too small? Are these gonna be too, way too small? Those are cute, but like they're, they're just so small. I think this one is gonna be best. These are my stupidly tiny little boxes. I feel like I need something a bit shorter and a bit like wider, just but just one to go there because then it kind of like evens out. I uh, will find a different one, but just imagine that was bigger. That's how that would look. And then obviously pick up my little cherry dish, which I'm obsessed with. And I was thinking for this, maybe stuff just looked like clips and stuff, which I can just keep in here because there's always clips and always little things that I always have in the bathroom. I've got a few like little spare jewelry bits which I don't wear every day, but I still like to have. So, I mean, these could always go in here too. I have filled up my new little pull box. So the reason I got this is because obviously all these like container things, they don't look too pretty, but I need to have my, my vitamins out, otherwise I won't take them. So I put my fish oil in, vitamin D, vitamin C, and Agnes Castus. The next thing is the lights. So as I mentioned, I got what I get, wanted to get lights to go under here, like this. I'll show you with the lights off. Will I use them? I don't know if this is such a waste. These are like 15 pound as well. I'll put the batteries in all of them and then I can like hold, like maybe blue tack them up before I stick them. And then I can see what the light is like and decide whether it's worth it because if I'm not gonna, be gonna use them, I don't, wanna, I don't wanna keep them, you know what I mean? They look actually really cute, okay, ah! It looks so professional. It's pretty bright and you can shower in it. Oh, I love that so much. Time to get rid of this hair towel. Oh my gosh, it's massive. That's like the size of my body towel. And this is the little, the turban wrap. Would you put it on this one or maybe on the top? Yeah, I think maybe on the top. Now it's time for the toiletry haul. Of course, along with doing the bathroom decor, I also had to stock up on some toiletries. I really, really, really recommend these to you. These are the Kiss Nude Nail. This will be this is my second third pack actually that I've bought. They're a little more expensive, eight pounds, but like compared to getting your nails done in the salon, like they are a fraction of the price. These are the nails, and this is I've had them on for three weeks today. Three weeks. Stick ons, like they are unreal. So I really, really recommend. I also grabbed some new of my gradual tanning lotion. This is the tan that I use when I want to tan. I probably use lotion over an actual tan. I picked up the Nivea Q10 firming lotion. I picked up a new hairspray. I spent 10 pound on zinc tablets and I didn't even mean to buy zinc. I meant to buy bloody vitamin C plus zinc ones. I now have five months supply of zinc. So fingers crossed it doesn't break me out or anything. And then to go with the three for two offer, I also picked up the two magnesium. I picked up a new liquid blush from Revolution. This is in the shade Flushing For You. This is in the shade Shib Fizz. Just a little lip gloss. I also got a clear lip gloss, a clear mascara. This is a collection um, gel like eyeliner and I got it in a brown because I really like wearing brown but mine just didn't look great because I was using my eyebrow pencil so this is really good. I really like this. Couple last things, I got a new shower cap. As I said in boots, there were some bits I couldn't pick up like my face wash and stuff, they didn't have in store so I did some online orders. I picked up a, another one of the Cordley Vida Perfect Serum. They had like a deal where you pay 50 quid, which is what this is. I know that's expensive. But you got a free sun cream for like free. Duh, obviously. This is a new sun cream, the Cordley 50 Plus Ocean Protect one. And funnily enough, I've been wanting to try a new sun cream because as I mentioned in my last video, my La Roche-Posay one's like really been like stinging my face. Like it's not normal, I don't think. So I thought, oh, okay, this will be a good chance to try this out. I picked up another one of the Cordley Vino Pure Toners, which is great. I use this in the morning. Also picked up the cleanser. Then I got a brand new Paula's Choice Exfoliant and and I ordered, chose to order a Space and K because I paid less and got the travel version for free. It's time. 
time for the final bathroom reveal. As an overview, I've heard these changes are small, but like I've heard they do make a difference. Got the gorgeous greenery at the top. I've also just cleaned the bathroom, so hopefully it looks a little bit better than it did before. And then obviously got the brand new little tray of stuff and over here i decided so i did try and return these like i said but then on amazon it was like oh don't even send them back they just gave me my money back so i feel like i'm just gonna make these little ones work for now because they, they were free got these prints up and i i am genuinely obsessed with these and i think i'm gonna put three more in the other bathroom then just got my new shower cup and my new little hair towel I just think this makes it look so, so much better. So, so, so much better. I am so happy with it. Obviously in here, nothing much has changed, but I've just got restocks and got some new products. And I think when I'm filming, it's just gonna look so nice in the background. As I said, I will leave all the Amazon stuff I can find linked down below so you can check it out for yourself. Love you guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.